The issue of troubled families has been a major concern in Warwickshire, just as it has everywhere else in Britain, but efforts made by the County Council appear to have made a big impact. Warwickshire's Priority Families programme, part of a UK-wide initiative, has been successful in turning around the fortunes of 797 families in the county. Problems like truancy, criminal activity, long-term unemployment or antisocial behaviour have either been greatly reduced or eliminated altogether as a result of the scheme. The figure represents 99% of the families the council set out to help over the last three years, easily beating the target of 90% success and earning Warwickshire praise from the government as one of the most successful local authorities when it comes to tackling difficult families. As a result of this success, Warwickshire has been chosen to join a list of local authorities who will shape the second phase of the Priority Families programme, which starts next month. The second phase will place more emphasis on earlier intervention, helping families with young children and those with multiple problems. In other news, Stratford-on-Avon railway station is set for major improvements after the County Council joined forces with rail franchise holder London Midland to fund new developments. Warwickshire has supplied £250,000 on top of the £500,000 secured by London Midland from the Department for Transport's National Stations Improvement Programme Fund. As a result, passengers using the station will soon benefit from a new waiting room, cafe and shops. Warwickshire has also been offering residents £5 compost bins, but to make the most of this bargain, it is important for people to know how best to use them. It has been running a series of workshops for residents with events held in Nuneaton, Badsley Enzor and Warwick this week. A fourth workshop will be held tomorrow in Stratford.